Okay, and so we're back. Uh, inventory bullshit is done. Sup, Jethro. Thank you for not taking any of my shit. Now, if you look at me, wow. I am armed to the teeth. I Do I have enough swords? I am not sure. I have a lot of, I have, wow, I have three swords. And a fucking dagger, man. Do, do not fuck with me. I will fucking end you. Oh, cutscene. The Escalopian snake. I'd love to meet the fool who associated skin shedding with medicine. Oh. What? What? Maybe the skin sheddings have, like, some kind of crazy, like, protein or something in them, dude. You don't know? You don't know? Peddler. Ooh, do you have stuff? Come back tomorrow. Oh, okay. Well, I guess it's one of them kind of fucking days. Um, uh, maybe we have to come here in the day. Uh, that actually makes a lot of sense. At the minute, I'm just sort of, like, wandering through the... The shit here, that's a dog. Just looking for stuff. Um, but I'll resume recording when something that has a point is uh, happening. So hopefully we'll be back soon. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, all right, this is exciting. So, uh, sup, blacksmith bro. I'm getting out of here. I even, it even sounds like it's the same guy. Um, but yeah, so let's get this, let's see what's about, let's see what's about. What happens to the sword thing? Greetings, sir. Cool. You the smith's apprentice? Indeed, I yes. run the shop. Keep things tidy. Uh, what do you need? Nice, cool. Show me see what you got. I cannot. You don't come mm. recommended, and we only serve our own and friends. See ya. That's unfortunate. Uh, that sucks. Can you help? Human come to see a non-human. You need something. You guys I'm have not like entirely super human. And yes, you might have like something I need. Hatred. Malcolm Stein. Not a better blacksmith than all of a seaman. Okay, well, will you work with me, though? Will you sell me your wares? I only serve friends and those who come recommended. I won't have my goods used against non humans. Farewell. Sorry. What about monsters, though? What about, like, legit monsters? Me? Like, what about this? Nice workshop. You must be proud. But where's your equipment? Good question. They took it! Those sons of bitches! Now I must rent if I want to work. Thieves? That's no, shitty. worse. Damn city officials. Slap me with taxes on running a non-human business. Trading in non-human goods. Ah, that's How some the hell bullshit. do they imagine I'll forge things for humans? I'm a bleeding dwarf. Strange coincidence, too. That character okay. connected with the order recently acquired new Mahakam and anvils. Strangely similar to my own. Farewell. Alright. Bet you he'll give us our new sword if we get him his shit back. Uh. Yeah, so let's go do that. If we can figure out how. Because I really want that meteor sword. Oh, also, there are elf chicks. That is what they look like. They have this, like, strange, like, sort of fucking. Uh. Get so much. Yeah, I don't know what that means. Um, they have this whole strange, like, Vulcan shit going on, sort of. And but like with the massive foreheads, I don't get it. Whatever, doesn't matter. Um. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, no, that definitely does what I think it does. I would be willing to bet. I don't know for sure, but. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh boy oh god all right so let's go do stuff that has a point i actually wanted to pick the, the recording back up here because i noticed that we have a drowned dead contract for siegfried which um i actually think is the name of that hunter not 100 percent sure about that but the point is he wants drowned dead tongues and we need the bestiary entry for drowned dead in order to get those but we don't have those so that means there's gonna be a bookshelf like bookstore or some shit around here somewhere. There's gonna have to be, because otherwise I'm gonna get the bestiary in here, I'm not sure. Just out of curiosity, maybe we could get, like, better armor from this guy. Potentially. Where is the door? That's not the door. Where is the fucking door? Is it... Is it down? Is it, is it down a little bit? No? No, it's not down. Where is the door? This is the place, isn't it? Yeah, armor of the order. But where is the door? Because this is not the door. 
I want to talk to this Knight of the Order. This is what a Knight of the Order looks like? Hey, prick! We give our lives to the Order. They, uh, okay, fuck you. You do realize what they thought I, when they, like, thought that I was trying to fake your shit, man? They fucking threw me in jail. Red rope wearing ass wagon. <laughs> you look like a fucking cherry KKK member, dick. Order merchant, order armor. Oh, well, they came out. Alright, cool. Can we, uh, Greetings, can you we buy stuff? Sir. Nice can I have a look as you right. Yay, you actually will show us, uh, show us your shit. Alright, cool. Oh, nice. 5,000. Fuck me. Oh, no. Oh no. Oh shit. We're gonna have to think about this because now cause cause we can do different types of sword combinations. We could do a pure blue meteorite sword, and that's six hundred meteor, but this is five thousand Ah, this sucks. Alright, I'm gonna have to do a bunch of money making then and come back to this when we get all equipped up. That's probably going to take a while. Okay, so next interesting thing just happened. I just forged the meteorite sword. I went and I bought one of those blue pieces of meteorite anyway because from reading up on them, you, you really do want the pure ones. Um, and apparently uh, this one will is the only one that's actually got the damage based on combat style. Maybe I'll keep it. Maybe I won't. Oh, and we still keep our Witcher Steel Sword, which is cool, so we could... Uh, still use that if we had to just like the regular one and we also have this uh, and we also have a silver sword which we can do runes to we can put runes on if we have to and uh, we have the Temerian axe just in case so we need to dislodge a shield we can dislodge a shield only problem is it's like mounted to my leg just like uh, just like the the uh, dagger was so it like it like flies out in front of my leg really weird like I have a blade like just look out if you're in front of me because I'm liable to chop you in the fucking nutsack unintentionally and I'm really debating getting the battlefield just because of what you know like stun does and all that um, but anyway we don't need this anymore blue we're done with uh, we're focusing entirely on red and yellow because those make another like good pair of meteorite swords but anyway I need to find a way to make money in the city because I haven't I did the, some looking in between uh, takes and I couldn't find the zebra posts are bad neighborhood oh so this is the slums then um, I couldn't find a fucking uh, like bar oh well this is bouncers maybe this is a bar I didn't come down here before you little guys look a lot like Heron I murdered a guy who looked a lot like you guys um, but, I don't, I mean, I haven't been able to see anywhere where there might be any, oh, pfft. and then I look down here and there's a, there's a brothel, is it, oh, <laughs> oh, it's more hookers, that's, wow, alright, cool, you're gonna be busy in this quarter, but, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back when I get to, when I get something more interesting. Alright, so, I don't know why I can't click it now, but for some reason, uh, but I can confirm, having found this notice board, it was a notice board, I clicked it, I opened it, it was empty, all notice boards are connected by some sort of fucking black magic source. Alright, cool. That. So, good to know, the hairy bear, in if it's the hairy bear, why is there a fucking, like, cow's head on the wall? Uh, here's the innkeeper, I wonder if he's very well, the same. Well, well. Swords on your back. No, nope. different hair. name. But the You're voice doesn't the seem to fit. No, still a member. But I hear they're looking for you. Oh, you will need Good ice fat. for that burn. What can I get you? I hear fighting, so there's probably like a fat bread situation going on down here. Oh, found it. All right, cool. So we're gonna take on, I guess, butter bean. Oh God, whatever. They take on Butterbean. Uh, I'll actually you know, we'll see that fight. Why are the strongest guys always the fat asses? Oh my god. Alright, well, let's uh, let's do this tournament thing and we'll be right back uh, for the exciting final match with Butterbean. 
Finally, somebody with some fucking respect. This guy was like, there's no shame losing to the white-haired one because I am a badass. And this motherfucker knows it. Although I did miss an epic moment where this guy was looking down at him because because he was flat on his ass and he was face palming and it was fucking hilarious. All right, it is time for the final match against the butter bean. So what? Let's uh you an make a fucking fighter? burrito. You Smacked know? a few. Why? I defeated uh, Fat Fred, so I'm looking for another opponent. Yeah. You take issue with Fat Folk? No. Uh, well. No. No. I don't take issue with fat folk. But, you know, when you talk a lot of shit, you know, I, 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 I turn around and I say, step up, fool. Because I need someone who can, you know, at the very least, you know, make me, you know, get short of breath, maybe, you know, get a good workout, something like that. But so often am I disappointed by you fucking assholes who hang out in drunken bars, uh, you know, talking shit to every motherfucker who comes in, walking with, like, blades everywhere. So, eh, yeah, maybe I say just to piss him off. No. Are you fighting or are you running home to mama? What's the wager? 75 arons. Alright, cool. Any rules? But what's just the catch? One. No rules apply. Right. Oh, okay. So in? Can I just kill you then? I'm in. Can I just flat out just murder you, or do I have to beat you to death? Oh, oh, wow! You actually had some uh, some power behind that swing. But it's the same fucking thing over again. I can dodge by ducking two inches because these motherfuckers don't know how to throw a straight punch. They just like throw haymakers and like. Sorry, half excuses for like, uh, you know, jabs, I guess. And they, apparently, he he don't dance. He just pulls up his pants and does the rock away. So lean back and dodge fists. And this guy over here just has is bored. He's just like, all right, cool. Another dude died. Should have seen the look on his face when I did the last guy. He, he just was double. like, he just cocked his head aside and he was like, huh. Ah. Two like he has no cardio, fucking time. A golden for this. necklace or 150 orans. Oh, that's. Uh, oh well, that's wine. So the gold, 150 orans. Yep. Thank you. And ooh, 225. Don't know why we got that many, but anyway, we are well on our way. So yeah. All right, cool. Uh, cut to the next interesting thing. Huzzah! It's me, Munro. Exiles, the war, you, Sultan, and I helped them. You must remember. How's life? Can't complain, I have a nice... But I don't know this guy! As a bouncer, that's slow. Apparently Zoltan I told him that I'm still alive. Between themselves, but I don't know the dude! Place. Birds don't ever shit uh, in their own nests. Alright. Okay. Huh. All right. Well, I guess he'll, uh, we can ask him about the dice thing, but but we don't know this dude. So many motherfuckers. I'll find you. That later. like we apparently knew, and we're just running into left and right, but no one has. I still have not been told what the fuck. Oh boy. You know, I've talked some shit so far, but really, Vizima seems like a pretty nice place. I mean. Except for the rundown, shitty parts. But I mean, overall, it, I mean, this is definitely a step up from that fucking village bullshit. I'll give you that. So, it's daytime in Vizima now. Um, and I just talked to this woman here, and apparently her husband is dead. Died a month ago, and he is now flying around the cemetery shouting bullshit. Uh, okay, whatever. 200 orange, thank you. Move along. The town cemetery. Uh, the dead and undead await behind that gate. Plenty of work for a witcher. Yep. We actually have to go there at midnight to deal with some of said bullshit immediately. Alright. Cool. So let's talk to the gravedigger real quick. Will it be pine or oak, perhaps? I don't need a coffin. <laughs> Makes sense. Yep. Maybe we can do business. What business? 
A partnership. With those swords, you doubtless lop off a few heads occasionally. Yep. When you dispatch another true. soul, let me know, and you'll earn a share from the coffin. Really? Why? That's weird. You're weird. You're sick. Resourceful. It's just a job. Stop fooling. I need something else. What do you need? Right. I'm here about the notice. Yes. I guess he had a I notice. I understand you need six jugs of dog's lard. I want you to call as many mutts as possible. Bring me the lard as proof. Why? Whatever. Why is the cemetery shut? Because the dead refuse to rest in peace. Fear not. They stay mm. in their graves in sunlight. Someone should tend to them, though. Perhaps someone will offer a reward. But for now, no one seems bothered. What? What the? F they're they're fucking zombies at night, and no one is bothered. Why? What? How is that not an immediate issue? Ah. Oh. Okay. Whatever. Yeah. I'll deal with it when you agree to pay me. For now, farewell. Think putting a cool. dead body to rest is easy? Do what you will. Perhaps the watch captain will reward you. Oh. Hard to check. Yep. What do you need? No, that's uh, that's Very definitely well. uh, good. Uh, good to know. You're this huge is... and ugly. Yeah. Well, you're short and ugly too. So fuck off, you little bastard prick. Saint Lebiota's Hospital for victims of the Catriona plague. Only two stages after this. Old Vizima and Hell. Damn, I'm gloomy. <laughs> no, Geralt, you're not gloomy. You're just a fucking realist. You know, you know what is going down. Lots of fucked up shit. What are you gonna do about it? But anyway, um, I'm gonna get some directions and then uh, pick this back up. All right. So now, uh, basically, we've been spending a few minutes sort of coming up with. Uh, a good, like, oh, huh, there's a wolf's head on the end of that silver sword, that's cool. Anyway, we've been, we've been trying to come up with a good progression path as to, like, how we're going to get through this, and how we're going to get, you know, the Zima unfucked, because that's what I do. I find things that are fucked up and suitably unfuck them, um, but to do that, like I say, we have to, uh, with the promotion due to me, do I never stuff. need to the streets again. Yesterday, we were actually reading some of the quests and he said to talk to some city guys. Uh, so we uh, do that like real quick. But um, yeah, we decided that we're going to check out uh, Taller, I guess is how you pronounce it. See what happens in here. Wow. He's a fence. So he basically just uh, finds shit and sells it. Oh, that's Taller. Well, if you have a bunch of everybody's shit, I'm going to check and see if any of it is any good. Uh, all right, cool. Huh. Honestly, you know, the last time I came into a house this nice, I uh, got attacked by ghosts in the basement. So we're gonna go do that real quick. Come down here. Just make sure we don't get attacked by ghosts, because if we do, we want to get that taken care of. Um, and it's a tragedy, but I didn't get that on camera. The whole. Uh, like going downstairs and being like told that you know like you know death kills us because of you which are like you know I'm out running death all the time and everyone around me is dying as a result hi Tyler wow fence. you look like I'll shit buy and sell what you deal in everything worthwhile um, yeah so, so stolen goods be? basically we're doing some plowing business I'm curious to see what he has real quick what did, uh... Hmm. Yeah. What, what, uh, how'd you get, uh, Ber Beringer's, Beringer's sword? The city guards found a witcher's sword at your place. First of all, it's the cocksucking guards. Second, why do you care? Another witcher, Berengar, came to see you. Well, it wasn't his fucking razor. How do you know that? I have your boyfriend's other property. The sword I got elsewhere. Other property? Right. Meaning not his sword, got it? Like his undershorts that he pissed all over or something. Huh, that's weird. Hmm. So where did you get the sword? 
What'll you give me if I tow you? I'll stop short of gutting you. Fair offer. I bought it from a man at the Hairy Bear Tavern. Care to describe him? No need. He's the most famous dice player around. Out fucking standing. A real goddamn magician. Huh. Cool. How did you get Berenger's property? Stubborn hmm. ass fellow, aren't you? From a middleman. Yeah, why though? Huh. Where do I find him? At the Hairy Bear Tavern. Doubt he'd want to talk to you. Lots of people Man at the fucking tavern. Hmm. Have you heard of Salamandra? Piss-swilling reptiles. I've heard of them, but I've no fucking idea what they want. Amphibians. Huh? What? Salamanders are amphibians. Now tell me your connection to them. I'll be proud if I know. Hmm. You do business with Salamandra? You I'm very interesting. Off your horse? I'm very How interested in uh, where this Dogs is going. Balls, I'm a fence. Want me to draw your picture? You think I ask every thief who he plowed for his goods? Let me draw you a picture. A certain organization, Salamandra, has it in for witchers. A witcher, Berengar, disappears, and all he had lands in the hands of a fence. You. Getting this? A pox on pictures. Berengar's nothing to me. My suppliers might know more. Besides, I'd never survive in this business if I sold hot goods I actually had a hand in getting. Well, but do I believe you or not? You you got you have a good point, but that's believable. Innocent until proven guilty, I guess. So let's assume it's not you for now. I'd say so. Goddamn Dijkstra, a spy, dog's balls. What a clever analysis. If you figure anything out and need more information, creep on over and we'll talk. Sure. So what? We'll you gamble? Huh. I'm an absolute fucking lootly great poker player. Why? Care to play? Don't make me laugh. You're a swiving amateur. Get some practice before you fucking bother me again. Huh. Wow, we got shut the fuck down. All right. Uh, whatever. Eat a dog's asshole for now, Tyler. We'll be back. All right. We're back over at the end. Lots of shit going down at the inn, or so Toller would have us believe. So, yeah, let's uh, let's figure this fucking shit out, huh? So, aside from winning a bunch of money from Zoltan, as you can see here, didn't learn a whole lot in the inn. Uh, except for that the silver sword came from a gardener over at the hospital, so we're gonna go talk to that fucking person after these two motherfuckers. Shut the fuck up! Oh my god. Connections are everything. Jesus. What? What the hell are you motherfuckers talking about? Maybe not. I. I feel like that was more significant than I let on. But anyway, we're gonna head over to the hospital and see what's up with that gardener. Oh shit! Oh, I just talked to this guy named Ramsme, right? And apparently he's the king of the underworld, basically a douche wagon. But apparently we found out that Berengar has been scheming with Salamandra. What the fuck? I mean, jeez, talk about plot twist. Uh, I apologize I didn't capture that because this guy has this like. Real cool. Here, I'm gonna let you listen to how he talks. What do you want, Wolf? Ah, how old whores have wings. Beat it, Witcher. <laughs> uh, I like the way he talks, but still, dude's an asshole. Anyway, here's that guy Coleman we were looking for. Greetings. Look who's here. Who are you? They call me Coleman. What do you do? I sell things, travel about. Like where? Swamps recently, what do you care? Just asking. You buying? We'll have a look at what he has to see, uh, sell, and then we'll ask him about Salamandra. Really? That's it? I still wonder what this stuff does. Anyway. You buy. Ever seen the Salamandra sign? Believe me, be. But. Shavo. Oh, wow. Cunt doesn't want to talk. Surprise, surprise. Fuck off. Alright, cool. 
Uh, so real quick, let's just uh, see what this does. Whoa! Was not expecting that. What? What? Where did I end up? What happened? Oh, what the fuck is this? Silver sword, come on! Oh, there's a bandit. And I killed him. But I'm trying to kill the monster. This is not ideal. Admittedly, this is not ideal. I'm gonna use switch to group because there's like a bunch of people around here for me to destroy. And that seems to have done a pretty good job. We're gonna switch to steel. Oh lord. This was a hard fight. Oh and god shit. Well, didn't realize that would happen.